The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. From Perry, Oklahoma, weighing in at 275 pounds, he is a real American, Jack Swagger. Wow, the roof nearly blew off the arena for this superstar. Uh, this guy's got his work cut out for him here tonight. I can assure you of that. And approaching the ring from Louisville, Kentucky, weighing in at 275 pounds, Baron Corbin. Oh boy, we're in for a treat tonight. Both of these superstars look geared up and ready to go. Colin, this one's going to be a real treat, Michael. And I know you feel the same way. Yep, so does Kay. Jack Swagger, it's time for everyone to live in his America. Oh, out of nowhere! It seems the focus of his onslaught is directly on the back. This is going to be brutal. Yeah, that back is in bad shape. As we watch Baron Corbin, let's get your take on him. Growing up in Perry, Oklahoma, Jack Swagger loved both amateur and professional wrestling. Swagger idolized wrestling legend Danny Hodge and the famed Dr. Death Steve Williams. Both greats helped Swagger on his journey to WWE. The sky's the limit. I see a lot of main events in the future. Jack Swagger is looking mighty impressive as of late. Narrowly avoids the attack there. That was rough. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Why well, is the guy his opponent, and what's he going for here? No, oh, wait, nice reversal. As a standout at the University of Oklahoma, Jack Swagger was a two-sport star in football and wrestling. Ultimately, Swagger wanted to follow in the footsteps of two of his childhood heroes, the amazing Danny Hodge and the powerhouse Dr. Death Steve Williams. Fighting from a position of full health here. Swagger got out of the way of that just in the nick of time. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Covers. King, before you brought up Jack Swagger being a two-sport star at the University of Oklahoma, Swagger actually earned a full scholarship for both football and wrestling. That's incredible at any level, but especially at an NCAA Division I school. Yeah, you're right, Cole. Swagger started wrestling when he was five years old. He lived for competition. It's just that now his attitude on what's considered good sportsmanship has changed a bit. Oh, out of nowhere! Ow! Hard kick to the ribs! Extra slow getting back to his face here. Look out! Move! Looking for the quick pin. I don't think even the referee was ready for that. Jack Swagger has found an answer here.
We're looking at complete domination here. You can bet every superstar on the roster is crowded around the monitors in the back to see which one of these guys comes out victorious. And that's how you do it. The range of emotions here is startling. There's almost an unknowing of what to expect. I know. I, I mean, I got goosebumps. This match is going to be so unpredictable. I just can't wait. That's called being driven straight down to the canvas. What power. No kidding. That was an awesome slam. Quick pen attempt here. If you're just tuning in, I want to welcome everyone to this broadcast at WWE. Coming to you from the capital, the Golden State, Sacramento. People have been wanting to see these guys go at it for a long time, and by the sound of this crowd, I think they're getting what they wanted. Fans despise Jack Swagger. I think a major reason for that is they know how talented Swagger is. He doesn't have to break the rule. And into the cover. One, two. You're taking a giant risk with your own well-being anytime you take the action to the outside. Look at this! He still comes. Makes the cover. One, two. The danger level just picked up a notch now that the action is spilled to the outside. You know, the audience may chant, We the people, when Jack Swagger enters the arena. But after that, they love nothing more than booing him right out of the building. Everyone knows that Swagger is nasty, and when the bell rings, he's looking to take people out. Disqualify this man. Hey, the shoulders are down. Swagger got out of the way of that just in the nick of time. Oh, he's in trouble now. Here we go, Jack Swagger setting it up. There she be, the gut wrench. I love to see a good gut wrench. One, two. And a kick out. And that's all that matters. This match continues. Can you believe the endurance of this guy? Can you believe what he's withstood here tonight? Not going to win many matches with that move. I gotta tell you, these guys are in the best shape I've ever seen them in. The quick reversal there by Baron Corbin. Hang on. Baron Corbin, what a maneuver. What a finish. The shoulders are down. Great offense by Baron Corbin. What's happening in there? I don't know if we've ever seen someone as large as Baron Corbin move like this. The guy's picking up steam, all right. Nicely timed shot by Baron Corbin. Oh, <laughs> what a shot. That did some serious damage. You can't take too many of those and expect to be in the match much longer.
Another amazing singles contest. These two never cease to entertain the WWE Universe. What a reversal. Not today. Too fast. Oh, wait. Nice reversal. Dishing out some serious punishment here. What an impact. That was thunderous. Talk about feeling something through the entire arena. Makes the cover. One, two. Great one-on-one -on -one action here tonight. It doesn't get much better than this. a message to the entire WWE locker room here. When you're beat up, the last thing you want to have to deal with is this amount of power. I think Jack Swagger, what a maneuver. This should do it right there. I think this is it. Things are not looking very good right now. Gonna have to find a way to regroup. You're taking a giant risk with your own well-being anytime you take. Look at this thing! Incredible! He set it up. Swagger with a beautiful counter. You know, I hate to say it, but Swagger really can do it all in the ring. Jack Swagger has found an answer here. Now that's offense. After you're on the receiving end of something like that, you wish WWE had timeouts. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Wow, that was a wild strike. Talk about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. Whoa, a direct hit. Talk about getting tagged and knocked in the middle of next week. We're looking at complete domination here. I don't know how much longer he's gonna be able to go. When he gets going like this, there are a few better. Incredible. It's amazing what happens when a competitor channels all. Looking for all of the glory here. Two, three, three. Oh, wow, what a win. We may be looking at the match of the year. Let's take a look at some of the big highlights. I can't believe what we just saw. Well, I don't know how you can pick out highlights from that match. The whole match was highlights. Here's your winner, Baron Corbin! Wow, huge pinfall win here tonight. Let's not overcomplicate things. This business is simple. It's all about wins and losses, and it sure looks to me like somebody has figured that out. What a match, and thank you for tuning in as we come to you live from Sacramento.